Greetings to the Bishop Girton High School graduating class of 2020. This is Michael Malley here. I am a Bishop Girton alumnus, and I graduated from Bishop Girton in 1984. That's right, 36 years ago tonight, I graduated from BG. This is, this is true, true. I'm going to show you a picture. That's me right there at BG. I had very, very curly hair. That's my buddy Craig Heisner. Listen, cameras weren't so good back then, or at least the ones that I could afford. But that's me right there in my gown. I didn't take my gown off all night. I think I slept in my gown. This is me in another picture, Bishop Girton High School. There's, there's some famous BG people here right now because that's Kenny Eaves, Coach Eaves, coaches the football team. That's me right there, young man. Uh, right there, and that's David Hewatt, another Nashville guy, and there's Rob Prunier, right? There's there's Rob. I think he's had 15 kids go through Girton now, uh, but such a dedicated volunteer for Bishop Girton. And I want to show you something else. Well, I brought this. This is how much pride I have in Bishop Girton High School. That right there, look at that. That's a big, big trophy. This trophy is almost as tall as me. You know what that is? That's the Bishop Girton Loyalty Award, 1984. Larry Elliott Loyalty Award. I guess they give that to you if you're not that great at sports. But anyways, <clears throat> I, I was actually very, very flattered to get that award. I still have it now. It's in my office. Because I'm so proud to have been a part of Bishop Girton High School, and I'm so grateful for what Bishop Girton meant to me in my life. The education that I got there, the people that I met, the friends that I have. And I wanna show you something else right now that's important when I talk about those friendships. Because here's a photo from my 50th birthday party. And we were at a party in Etna, New Hampshire, goofing around, taking photos like we used to for the Fellowship of Christian Athletes. And in that photo is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven friends of mine who I met at Bishop Girton High School. At the party, there was probably another 10 guys who had gone to Bishop Girton High School. And the point is this, the friends that you make in high school, the friends that you make in your hometown, in the Nashua area, those are friendships that if you want to, can and will sustain you for the rest of your life. So though this experience was a drag the last couple of months, not being able to finish up like you started, not, be able, not being able to have some of the experiences that you wanted to have, those transitional moments, which I think are important. The most important thing is that you have your health, you're healthy, your parents are healthy, and that you realize that these friendships that you've begun, that you've started here at Bishop Girton High School, are friendships that are going to sustain you for the rest of your life. Remember, your friends are the family that you choose. And now as you move into this new area of your life where you're an adult and you're going out into the world uh, eventually, I want you to try to think about that. Think about making friends. Now, if you're one of those people who's just like, I can't wait to get out of here and I'm done with this town and I'm done with this school and I can't wait to, that's fine. That's okay. But try to in whatever endeavor that you go into, try to focus on connecting with people, loving people, being kind and thoughtful people who believes in friendship. Because I'm telling you, as you navigate your way through the world, as I have in the 36 years since I have left Bishop Girton High School, I must say that the one thing that unites all people is love and friendship. There will be ups, there will be downs, there will be valleys, there will be peaks. But if you have great friends, if you have strong friendships, that is the thing that will make your life feel alive and will give you comfort and will give you ballast. Look it up. I learned it in English class at Bishop Girton. Your life, your friendships will give your life ballast. It's a drag that this period of time, which would have been very festive 
has now taken on the color of um, something a little quieter. But this is not something that's going to continue. You're going to get out of this. We're all going to get out of this. And hopefully we're going to have our health intact. But just remember, this is a momentous occasion. Just because you're not hanging all around doesn't mean that it is still not a momentous occasion that deserves to be toasted and deserves to be noted and deserves to be applauded. I know how hard going to school with Bishop Girton can be for some people. And I just want you to know, uh, as somebody who finished right there in the middle of the class and did not do very well on my SATs, I'm doing fine. I'm, do I'm doing fine. So parents, okay, th here's a good thing. Parents, pump the brakes a little bit on the pressure. Would you, would you just let the kids, this is now to the parents of the kids out there watching, just let them relax for a little bit, would you? Just let them relax this summer. Let them play some video games. All right? Just let them relax. Tell them, don't stop getting all over their case, being on their phones. Good luck. I'm rooting for you. Congratulations.